Let's welcome back to some more Persona 3 Reload, where last time we took down the Reverse Chariot and Justice Shadow Boss, in which that was a really weird boss. I actually really like it. I love how unique of a fight that is. And as a result of our efforts, gained a new party member who is now the Doge. Uh, speaking of which, uh, rest in peace, Doge meme dog. Uh, yeah, at the time of this recording, he literally passed away today, and I'm very sad about that. Rest in peace, Doge. But, uh, at least now we have Doge in this game. And this time, we are, I guess, just hanging out. Um, we're not going to Tartarus for a very long time, so... For right now, Koromaru is gonna be unexplained. Holy crap, you're already in the same level as Igus, and she's been leveled up a little bit. That's kind of terrifying. <laughs> whatever. So yeah, I'll talk about Koromaru once we go into Tartarus. There's also a couple of things now that we can... Well, not that we're higher leveled, we can actually fuse some new personas, but... I'm gonna wait for that till Tartarus, specifically for the fact that it's kind of pointless to us for right now. So for tonight... We have a closeout sale, apparently. It's not about my business, yes. So, I think I mentioned this before, but as long as they're upable, yep, okay. This will be the last time we ever hang out with the Devil Social Link, and the thing is, when you get to the very end of a link, you don't need the matching Arcana anymore. Now, I'm keeping Baphomet because, well, he has a high-level persona, but yeah, just keep that in mind for if you need to clean up space on yourself or whatever. As long as you get to rank 9 and they're upable in the next rank, then you can you don't have to equip the persona matching their arcana because they're going to rank up anyway, so what's the point of getting extra points? I digress. It's you. 100% free. Not really, considering I paid you so much money just to just talk to you in the first place. I've decided to make a donation. They're raising money to help uh, orphans in foreign countries. Don't get the wrong idea. I'm not doing this out of the goodness of my heart. It's a long-term investment. Children who learn to cope with adversity are more likely to become rich and famous, like me. I'm thinking of donating 10 million yen. Uh, not a corporate donation, but a private one. But when I told them over the phone, they sent me this. Received it the very next day. Guess I can't back out now. Ten million yen is nothing to me, though. Once those children grow up and become successful, I'll introduce myself to them. I'll say, I'm the one who made all this possible. Then I'll be well taken care of in my old age. If it wasn't for our conversations, I probably wouldn't have considered this. By talking to you, I seem to have developed an interest in watching others mature. I thank you for that. Actually, hmm, I should be thanking myself for so wisely taking note of this. You are a leech upon society. But it's a leech that helps us out in the long run, so I guess it's not that bad. The queen, the queen. Ultimate power of the devil. Which is not really a great thing. This is our second social link that's maxed out, I believe. We can now fuse be uh, fu yeah, fuse Beelzebub. I was trying to combine the words fuse and Beelzebub. Prince of Demons. You can keep that letter. Ten million yen. I worked myself to the bone for that money. And all I have to show for it is that piece of paper. But it's not a bad feeling. Yeah, because you're trying to leech off of people. I'll be going now. The paparazzi could be anywhere. If any one of them were to find out, my brilliant plan would be ruined. Oh, by the way, about that exclusive modeling contract, I've decided to pass on that deal. Rather, it's your fault for sending me mixed messages. Anyway, quit associating with shady middle-aged men like me and find what truly makes you happy. Bye forever. <laughs> That's like the one time he's ever shown kindness. Jesus. That's just for us to say to stay the hell away from him. Well, at least he's being honest about his demeanor. 
Time for the home shopping channel. Oh, great, yeah, we're gonna give him more money. I mean, depending on what he's selling. Hey, Tanaka, how are you going? Uh, isotope soda, mad book. 20 of them? Hell yeah, I'm buying that. That's SP recovery. We've been having issues with that recently, too. Granted, it'll become less of an issue later on, but still, it's nice to have. Uh, oh, some summertime fun. If you, if you spend your vacation doing nothing, summer will be over before you know it. Listen, man, you gotta help me with this my, my crazy genius idea. So hurry up and haul your ass to the strip mall. Right. We'll take care of that in a second. First of all, uh, we want... What do we want to do? I mean, there's a couple things. Uh, is Karamaru downstairs? He probably is here. Because I think we do want to talk to him. Hey, buddy. Good doge. Also, I forgot that you can talk to people down here during the day. Uh, might as well chat with everybody. By the way, I have heard that Koromaru san. What is wrong with me? Koromaru san's persona is Cerberus. This, appear, uh, this being appears in Greek mythology as the watchdog of the underworld. Considering how Koromaru san was guarding the shrine alone for some qu er, quite some time, it suits him perfectly. Uh, spoiling more personas. Let's see. It must be easier taking Koromaru on walks with the uh, with the nights being cool this time of the year. Dogs can't regulate their body heat by sweating, you see. So remember to keep an eye on him. He's also covered in fur. <laughs> I wonder if Karotron is uh, enjoying dorm life. I really hope he'll get used to it and then come to love it one day. I hope so too. Hey, uh, Ken. Oh right, this is Karamaru's new home, isn't it? It's gonna be a lot of fun with him around. No kidding. Sports and school work the same. No matter how strong you are, those who don't put in the effort fail. It's the same with school. If you don't study, you won't pass your tests. Okay, Dad. <laughs> Jesus. All right. Um, I think that's why is that? Oh, I know why. Okay. My notes have this stupid. So first of all, why do we? Why is it telling me to go here? Okay, we'll check that out in a second. First, Naganaki Shrine. Four. There's someone here that's never been here before. You. Huh. Your eyes are so clear. Your soul must be burning brightly. Uh, I have impressive academics. Apparently, he can tell just from looking at my eyes. I beat my chance to get him to know better. I can't say. The me, I see reflected in your eyes of the real me, if there is one. How far apart are they? Uh, three light years? Of course. Yes, that's about right. A long, lonely distance to travel. Oh, that's right. Words are very beautiful. If I had something to write with, I'd note them down. I have a fountain pen. It uses red ink. Blood red. My pen is my supporter, my spokesman, and my friend. However, it seems to have disappeared. Without it, my screams are silenced. Uh huh. That's what I was remembering. I don't know why my notes have this really weird way. Anyways, we want to head back into the dorm. For the culprit is Koromaru for some reason. Hey, buddy, I I need that pen. Can you move your paw? Good boy. Why do you have this? All right, so. Uh, yeah, we don't want to spend time with the guy yet. We just want to grab his pen for now. Um, okay, what is going on here? Why is this, like, yelling at me? Oh, because he's here. Okay. <laughs> well, I was going to hang out with Junpei anyway, so, uh, we're hanging out with Junpei. Yo. Oh, yeah, hi. Yes, I got your message. <laughs> Told me to haul ass. That's the thing we need. That's one magnificent melon, ain't she? It's the highlight of my day. So, I've been thinking of throwing a watermelon splitting party. Uh, why? We haven't really done anything summery since vacation started, you know? Especially Amada. He always looks so bored when I see him in the dorm. And man, that kills me to see. It'd be a real shame if he didn't have a single entry in his summer picture diary. That's so thoughtful of you. Already see the look on his face. He'll be like, Jupei-san, you're super cool and you're super nice. 
Oh, I mean, don't you know? They say women can't resist a guy with a soft spot for kids. That's your motive. And you know what that means? I'm gonna need your help. It's a win-win situation, don't you think? Yeah, anywho, no boy. I think my arms are gonna fall off. Ah, yes. Today shaping up to be a glorious day. It's such a shame that the third years and the ladies won't be joining us. Um, if we're splitting watermelons, I'm out. What? Just like that? You're not even gonna hear me out? You have a watermelon and a bat. What else could it possibly be? That's more for little kids anyway. Plus, it's really hot out. And look, I get you're trying to be nice. You should join us. Yeah, for real! Without you, it would just be me and him, you know? And isn't that just the saddest thing you ever heard? Well, when you put it that way, I guess I don't have a choice. I know, Koromaru. Don't you worry, boy. We didn't forget about you. All right! What are we waiting for? The youngest gets to draw first blood. Now this is what real summer feels like. My blood's pumping something fierce. Look who's acting like a kid now. <laughs> oh yeah, where's the blindfold? We can't split watermelons with just a bat. Speaking of, this bat seems kind of worn in, doesn't it? Oh, wow. You got that. That bat and I go way back. Had it since I was in Little League. I've never mentioned this before. That's news to me. Well, I must have never had a chance to talk about it. That I used to play baseball. I mean, anyway, that's old news now. Wait, then should we really be hitting watermelons with this? Hmm? Ah, uh, well, nah, it's cool. Don't think I'll be using it much from here on out. What's wrong, bud? Dying to chomp on some melon? Garmar's down to town something. Hey, come on, Koromaru. We can't swing at the watermelon with you in the way. Koromaru? Hey, why don't we use something other than the bat? What do you want to use? Um, anything, I guess. Just as long as it's interesting. Interesting? Kind of a weird request. Oh! Like if Sonata-san used his bare hands? Someone say my name? Whoa, Sonata-san! <laughs> well, when I got back, I thought I heard voices coming from the roof. So I came to check it out. Hmm. Watermelon splitting, huh? That's right! We were just talking about what to use to hit it! You're not gonna use that bat? We want to use your fists. My fists? On this? Oh my god, yes! I'd actually love to see that! That's okay, right, Junpei-san? Huh? Uh, sure. If that's what you want. Alright. Guess I'd better make this good then. Hey, try not to go all out or there won't be any left to eat. Whoa! Sonata-san, you're incredible! What the heck? How are we supposed to eat it now? I can't believe that thing was still edible after it exploded like that. Didn't go exactly how I was expecting, but it looked like a mod act. <sighs> Man, I was acting kind of lame back there, huh? You know, before we busted the melon. I'm talking about the whole bat thing. You were just trying to be thoughtful. I didn't want to come off like I was having second thoughts, but I guess I couldn't help it, huh? I was supposed to be this cool mentor, but instead, the kid ends up pitying me. 
It's still a start. <laughs> Don't worry about me anymore. I'll just get even sadder, you know? I mean, I'm not saying it's your fault, dude. Uh, how the hell do I put it? Uh, this is a me problem. It probably doesn't make sense. I feel like my life, my teenage years, it's just all over the place. Anyway, I think we're done for today, yeah? Appreciate you helping me prep and clean up. Well, let's head back downstairs. And pointless charm. And watermelon splitting, I guess, is a thing. I don't know. Probably gonna be a controversial thing. Oh, hello. Ah, good evening. I just came by to check in on Koromaru. Do you think he'll do well? He'll be fine. That's good to hear. Well, given his reputation for loyalty, I wasn't too worried in the first place. If you have any concerns, please feel free to let me know anytime. It's only fair, considering I was the one who requested that Koromaru join the squad. Oh, I'm all for Koromaru joining us. He's totally welcome. I'll even throw in training lessons from the master. Um, I'm pretty sure Korachan's already more disciplined than you. Could you even sit still if someone told you to stay? Hey, don't compare me to a dog. I'm totally disciplined. I can follow directions. Kinda. Yeah, you really sold us on it. Anyway, so, Mr. Chairman, uh, about those summer classes. Ah, yes. I heard about Kirijo-kun's plan. It sounded like a good idea, so I went along with it. No, why would you agree to that? Oh, was I being nosy? Oh, I'm missing out on my passionate summer romance. She's disappearing before my eyes. Farewell, my beautiful city girl. Awaiting me by the shoreline. The city or the shores. Pick one. Even if you didn't have classes, you'd probably just bum around the station all day. You should just accept your fate. Oh, by the way, Mr. Chairman, weren't you about to tell us something before he arrived? Hmm? Ah, that's right. Aside from my unnecessary meddling, I do have another request for all of you. Does everyone have a moment? I think it's a good time for you all to get a routine health checkup. You know where Tatsumi Memorial Hospital is, right? Oh, that's where Sonata Senpai was treated before. With how much you've all been fighting lately, it'd be best to stay on top of your physical health. It wouldn't be good if your personas were causing any strain on your bodies, right? I expect it shouldn't be too much of a detour to stop by the hospital after your summer classes. I understand. Still, this is rather sudden. Don't worry too much about it. Like they say, a stitch in time saves nine. Or your side. We'll be doing the checkups individually, one day at a time. You can decide amongst yourselves who goes when. Don't forget to deck up for your checkup. <laughs> uh, just kidding. Oh! Maybe bring your evokers in case you need to take any shots. <laughs> I'm about to shoot you. Yes. Uh, oh, hi. He'll need to be taken on walks, but we won't. Uh, we won't be assigning that duty to anyone in particular. It would help if you could take Koromaru out for a walk at night if it seems he wants to go for one. Uh, that's just an optional thing. That's kind of like a hangout thing. Uh, he's not even wanting to go on a walk right now. Let's see if it's outside. Uh, Fuka's outside. Oh, okay, yeah, Parmar's outside. So, uh, the controversial thing I was gonna say is that I don't actually like watermelon. That is the controversy. <laughs> so much bad things, yes. No, I, I've never liked watermelon. I like watermelon flavored things, but then again, that's just candy. Uh, but yeah, I've tried watermelon by itself. I, I just don't like it, man. It's just, uh, I don't know. I'm not much of a healthy eater. I don't know. I don't want to hear that your grades are slipping because you're spending too much time in Tartarus. I've been top of my class the entire time. There's nothing I can do to help with that. 
So study hard and do your best in summer school. I hate you. Why are you making me waste my time in summer school? Uh, oh, he's just showing up here. Uh, you rarely show up up here. Uh, hi, Fuka. Um, uh, I like how we can go into Tartars if we so wish. Let's see. I'm not wanting to... Uh, I get not wanting to attend summer school, but I think it's necessary. After we defeat the rest of the Shadows, we'll become ordinary high school students again. And if we fall behind in our studies now, we'll be in big trouble later. I'm the only one that has yet to have an issue with that. Even Mitsuru has, has been having issues. I'm good. <laughs> That's it. Junpei the Wise has yet another brilliant idea. All, we have to do, all I have to do is become a dog. Then I won't have to go to summer school either. Uh, yes? Don't encourage him. Uh, I bet he's complimenting me for being so smart. Are you stupid or something? He's laughing at you saying how stupid you are, stupid. I love how she still calls him Stupe. Mm. Summer school starts tomorrow. Honestly, the more I think about it, the more I'm dreading it. Yeah, seriously. Damn right. Hey, Karamaru, want to switch places with me? What is, what is with Junpei and picking on Karamaru all day? So, uh, here's the fun part. Here's the fun part. From Actually, let me point the calendar. That makes most, the most sense. So, starting from tomorrow all the way until the 15th, we can't do squat. Uh, yeah, our entire week is just summer school. Now, the good thing is that we do get a lot of academics points, so it does help out in that regard, but yeah, it's just a waste of time for the most part. I don't really like how they did this, but again, it does help you get the points that you need. For tonight, we're hanging out with Mutatsu because, well, we have no other things we can do. I mean... I guess we could go to the arcade, but I mean, we have a guy here. Hey, Mutu uh, Mutatsu. Yep. Mutatsu. Jesus. I keep wanting to put an O in his name. I keep thinking it's like Mutatsu, but no, it's it's Mutatsu. You. Hi. I thought your face looked familiar. You here again, kid? <laughs> Even Buddha's not that forgiving. All right, that's it. I'm going to hand you over to the bouncer and... Well, there's no Buddha in this world, so stop looking at me like that and sit down, kid. So tell me, is it that fun hanging out with an old monk whose own wife and kid left him? How come you're always alone when I see you? Don't you got any friends? I don't have any friends. Well, either you like being alone or you've got problems. In any case, well said. No hesitation whatsoever. Don't worry if you don't got any friends. Most of life's troubles come from human relationships anyway. Let's define a friend as someone you hold dear. The way I see it, no one in this world ever really cares for others. People always want something out of a relationship. They only really love themselves. You don't call someone who doesn't like you your friend, do you? No. Because you know you won't get nothing from them. Which means in this world, there's no one you can truly hold dear. At the end of the lonely road of love, kid, you're the only one left standing there. What? You see those gals over there? The ones on the dance floor? You can bring one of them over here. I'll be your friend in return, eh? What do you think? I know you can do it. You dirty old man. Also, that's a horribly de like, depressing way to look at, uh, well, friendships. I hold my friends very dear. Too tired to go talk to him, huh? <laughs> you look like you're gonna doze off any second now. Go home for now, kid. Besides, I know you're gonna come again anyway. Even if I tell you not to. Well, at least you're not making me get forcefully removed via bouncer. Ye. Then again, the bouncer's the one who let me in, so uh, I don't, I don't know. Ah, uh, yay, summer school, because we got signed up for it when we don't even need it. Good morning. Uh, hi, Yukari. By the way, have you heard anything about the dates for the health checkup? I haven't. What, really? I told Junpei to let you know. 
Yours is on August 14th. Anyway, it's seriously way too hot out here. Let's hurry up and get inside. I need to be in a classroom with air conditioning stat. They probably don't have the air the air conditioning on considering it's summer school. Unless if you paid for it. And yeah, summer school. That's what I'm saying. Literally this entire week is just gonna be this. Which is, why? I think if you had enough academics rank, you should have been able to choose if you want to do the summer school or not. Granted, that, oh god, it's Let's you. Get on with today's Hi. Yeah, I'm skipping through your crap, because look how much he rambles. This man is only speaking Japanese, man, and we're in Japan. Like, look at this. That, there's a, we would be here for like 20 minutes just talking. No. S shut up. <laughs> I mean, seriously, I, I think it would have been cool, like, if you had the high enough rank in your academics, they should have been like, oh, you could cho you could choose to do summer school if you want the extra points or not. That way you can actually at least work on social links. But no, you're forced throughout these uh, summer school antics. I don't know, I think it would have added some replayability in that case. Especially in New Game Plus, because, uh, yeah, even if you <laughs> have max rank, you're still forced through summer school. Which is kind of annoying, but, and, uh, I'll stop getting annoyed by that. Blowing through the days. Then again, it's not the only time in a Persona game where they just waste all of your days unnecessarily. But, actually, when was in P5 that they did that? I mean, I guess all the Morgana times. <laughs> All the times Morgana would just not let you leave the house at night, but whatever. I'm getting off topic. Time to head to summer school. I need to... Okay, yeah, today's our checkup day. Oh, God, it's you again. Ah, uh, look how much text. Is, why is he talking about Moses? And whatever the hell that is. Yeah. I'm sorry for not reading all of this, but... I mean, look how much this guy just yaps on. It, it's ridiculous. I, and it's not even interesting stuff. I, I do not care to read it, so... Read it at your own will. That's your uh, incentive to play this game yourself. I should go to Tatsumi Memorial Hospital. Thanks for being so patient. That just about concludes your checkup. Sorry yours ended up taking so much longer than everyone else's. That's all right. Oh, I'm glad to hear you say that. Although we could have done it another time and taken a full day for it. Your persona abilities are rather unusual compared to the others, aren't they? That's why we had to run so many more tests on you. Well, based on how you've performed so far, I don't expect there to be any problems. Persona abilities can be dangerous, depending on how they're used. With that in mind, it can't hurt to err on the side of caution. How are you feeling about it? Do you have any concerns about your power? None at all. Good to hear. And I don't think there will be any issues with your test results either. I truly am grateful for everything the team has done, especially you. Things have really changed for the better since you arrived. Our team has grown, and we've even figured out how we can eliminate the dark hour. In a way, you've sort of gotten the clock ticking for us again. It's almost as if we were just waiting for you these past 10 years. <laughs> I'm afraid I can only support you from behind the scenes, but I'll be counting on you to eliminate the four remaining shadows. Now then, it's getting pretty late. Why don't we get you back to the door? Oops, excuse me for a second. Hello? Oh, thanks for your help the other day. Uh huh. Yes. It's missing from that document? It's urgent? Wait, but, but by today? Looks like you received an urgent call. I should head back to the dorm alone. Iwatodai. Iwatodai. This is the final train bound for Tatsumi Port Island. Please board before the scheduled departure time. Ah, 
Yeah, this seems familiar. Or like a callback. Oh, it looks like you're at Iwatodai Station now. It's so late. We were starting to get worried. Um, did you run into any trouble? My checkup took a while. Oh, I see. I hope everything's all right. I'll let Kirijo Senpai know. We're in the command room right now. I'll go ahead and navigate you back to the dorm. I'm sure you'll be fine, but considering what happened with Korochan, I'd rather play it safe. Thanks. <sighs> Wait, I can sense a shadow! And it's really close to you! It's over at the Moonlight Bridge! It's too dangerous to go alone. You should stay put until everyone else gets there. Oh no! There's another reading near the shadow! It's a person! I'll buy some time. Oh, wait! Oh my. And what have we here? So much power, so much chaos. I'd not be foolish enough to turn my back on such a predator. And on top of that, we have an unexpected guest tonight. Not a very favorable situation, all things considered. So, given this little predicament, how do you intend to partake? Let's see what you've got. So long as you aren't against me, I will allow it. I don't know what our foe is capable of, but I trust you can protect yourself. A weird fight against this thing, but... What a hapless night, is it not? Well then, shall we begin? We're tag-teamed with Takaya. Okay, debilitate. What to do? I have Dekonda, right? I remember getting... Uh, I have... Right, I have Dekaja, but not Dekonda. Crap. Well, that sucks. Uh, okay, well... What do I really want to do here? Uh, don't really worry about this fight too much. Just live. That's all you really need to do. I guess I can just go to Baphomet. Sure. Let's do a Rakunda. Just do some random stuff. As long as you survive, you'll be fine. Hmm. So that's your strategy. Meanwhile, he's just gonna hit him with a pistol. Ow. Alright. Let's burn you to a crisp. You resist that. Ah, uh, fine. It's tougher than it looks. This too is fate. Aegon? At least I blocked that. What to do? Oh, well, if you resist fire, might as well show it some ice. Do I have a good ice user? Uh, again, it doesn't really matter. Uh, you know what? Screw it. We'll go with Mothman. Mothman, hit him with the Megiddo. For so Which, for some reason, I keep mispronouncing as Megiddo, but it's Megiddo. That was quite the spectacle. But it's time to end this. You make a good target. As a reward for your efforts, let me show you my power. Come! Persona! How about this? The finale was surprisingly unsatisfying, wasn't it? You've got a crazy ass persona. Yeah, Takai is not really one to be messed with. The defeated shadow seems to have dropped something. Hmm. Your persona ability is truly fascinating. It's different from the one I saw the last time, isn't it? So. You can choose from multiple personas to fit the situation. You must be burdened with an extremely unusual fate. It seems your friend has arrived. Then I suppose I'll have to be on my way for tonight. What is your name? 
No reason to hide. It's Makoto Yuki. I'll see to it that I remember. Enemies though we may be, I'm not one for leaving a debt unsettled. I shall have to repay you another time. Are you all right? Did you already defeat the Shadow? Good work, but that was an unnecessary risk you took. The situation called for it. You can fill me in on the way back. In any case, I'm glad you're okay. I explain what happened on the way back to the dorm. Yes. Oh, there you are. You had a long night, huh? On that note, let's not go to Tartarus tonight. Uh, okay. I'm sorry. Thanks. I'd like to look into Strago with the chairman's help. If I find out anything, I'll let you know. Also, I understand your circumstances last night, but try to avoid staying out late from now on. Um, joke's on you. I'm actually going to be spending some time outside at night. Uh, it's fine. And last day of summer school. Yay. Hey, at least we got a crap ton of act uh, academics. I can't speak today. When can I ever speak correctly? Damn it. I'm trying, man. I'm trying to get better. I'm improving, I think. Uh, oh, I forgot I bought stuff. Thank you, Tanaka. With a lot of crap. At least summer school's over now, but doesn't it feel like we kind of wasted our summer vacation? Yeah, no shit! I'll have to make a bunch of plants to make up for it. I wonder if anything's going on soon. I have a suggestion. I am currently aware of a summer festival tomorrow and a film festival the following day. Oh. Oh, that's right. Wait, I guess. Are you thinking about going to the festivals? Yes. Indeed. My data indicates that festivals and other events of the sort offer unique experiences. So, for investigative purposes, I plan to infiltrate such a shindig. Yeah. Uh-huh. Well, try not to stand out too much. We've really gotta have Junpei stop teaching her new words. Huh? It looks like Kirisha Senpai and Sonata Senpai went out again. How do they still have energy after summer school? I'm so tired. I think I'm gonna go to bed early tonight. Not like we get much of a choice. Um. Kirisha Senpai and Sonata Senpai aren't around, so I don't think we can go to Tartarus tonight. I know we haven't been going very often because of summer school, but we don't have much of a choice on the matter. Yeah, especially when both of them are gone and they're all concerned about me when, you know, Takai is really the one that saved my ass. Yes. I have learned the meaning of the summer festival. It seems like a very interesting event. I am looking forward to equipping the special armor known as Yukata. This will be a new experience for me. Armor, huh? Before we end things off, I want to go over to... Who's a bit? Oh, Tatsu. Okay. Uh, there's a couple things I want to go and check out for a sec. Uh, we're not going to hang out with Mutatsu or anything. I actually want to go to the antique store because we got some stuff and I forgot to go and look at it. Uh, oh. Yeah, you're yes. talking about random stuff. So we have Which new one? stuff. We have a black so, sword. What will it be? All stats plus one? Jesus. Um, only one Malachite, too. I mean, yeah. Give you the nameless Katana. Here, it's all yours. I'll gladly take that. I'm out so, for the heal blade. What will it be? Uh, nothing really new here. I'm not gonna, actually, does the cloth do anything for like? anybody else? I mean, we just dizzy slash ma magic plus five. What the balls? I mean, it's only for females. That would be real. Well, eh, I don't know. I don't. Plus five magic is there nice, are but other people who can use personas, I mean, right? That does have a lot Try of cost. To get along with them. I'll keep that you in can mind. Most plus thirty in SP. Your friends. Jesus. I mean, not really anything useful for the guys, but still, E heal so, or what will it be? Uh, the boosts are nice, but nah. Go on. Look and around. nothing but new cards. No, um, I never explained what shift boost does. It raises the attack to the person that you shift to. So, 
there's that. Uh, career boost. The Endures are really nice. It basically just negates the whole one-shot mechanic, which, again, I, I, I kind of just wish they got rid of that. I know their staple moves are light and dark, but... They're just it. gimmicky. It's hard to keep track of where things uh, are when you have so much How much stuff? do they cost? Right, we can actually buy quite a few. How many? Four. Sure. Yeah. Uh, we can also buy Megito gems. Jesus. And Homunculi. Okay. Uh, I think we're good. Hope to see you soon. And before I forget, I am definitely putting on that katana because that's really freaking nice. Beautiful. Okay. So, I'm gonna head back to the dorm real quick. We're not hanging out with Mutatsu, because, well, we're gonna hang out with somebody else today. But, that is gonna be a, oh, okay, that's Ken. I was like, was that Akihiko, but no. And I would continue the episode. I know it's gonna be a little shorter than usual, but tomorrow is the summer festival thing, and I kinda wanna save that for next episode. So, I'm gonna do that right there. Next time on Persona 3 Reload, we'll hopefully not be ambushed by new people. But uh, at least we get to go to the Summer Festival, hopefully. So, I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.